What's up, YouTube? I'm back again with another video. Uh, this time it's on a uh, cologne, another cologne I touched on before. Had to kind of come back and do each one separate, as promised. Uh, this here is uh, Shades of Blue for men. This is made by Bell Camp Sense. Uh, this right here is a knockoff version of Dorsey Cabana Light Blue. And I'm going to let you guys check out the spray. Here we go. That's what the cap top look like. What the spray look like. Here's the cap right here. Alright. Get that aside. Check out the spray, guys. Good spray. Alright. And, um. What this smells like is kind of peppery. It's kind of light. Peppery is more aquatic feel, in my opinion. Uh, it's more like a kind of like a beachy, beach type scent. Um, it's kind of aquatic, uh, more like a I would say peppery, smooth, peppery type scent. Uh, the longevity and the projection of this this stuff is is fair. Uh, the projection is good, but the longevity, no, 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 I'll take that back. The projection is fair, the longevity is good. It's the other way around. <laughs> and it smell kind of, it's a light scent. I get that, I guess that's why it's called Shades of Blue. And it's more of a light scent, in my opinion. Uh, it doesn't really project that well. Uh, it's more of a, like I said, aquatic, subtle scent. Um, uh, ladies will like it, though. You know, I'm, I've got compliments with it before. And um, it smells good. You know, it just, like I said, it's light. And it doesn't really project a lot. Uh, the longevity I get from this is like maybe four to six hours give or take you know something like that uh for the eight dollars though it can't go wrong like like i said those of you who like dorsey and cabana light blue this is a um, knockoff version of that smell almost identical to the real thing it's got a little bit of its own twist going on with it um but it's a great scent like i said uh the ladies will like it you know that's basically all that counts. And, um, it smells good, though. And as it settles down, it's got kind of like a, uh, let's see. Still got that peppery vibe, kind of fruity vibe a little bit. Uh, it's more peppery and fruity, is what I get. Just a quiet scent, um. There's nothing really to um, hype up too much about this one, except it costs eight dollars at Walmart. Uh, this is a bell cam scent, another bell cam. Um, there's enough said basically about this one. Uh, me personally, uh, this one now one of my favorites. I liked it at first, but I thought why it's like it was so light. You know, it's like. I couldn't even smell it, so, you know, <laughs> so it gets so if I can't smell it, so, you know, ain't no need for me to wear it, you know, if I can't smell it. I got to be satisfied with it before anybody else do, guys, so, um, uh, that's why I stopped wearing it, you see, I wore about half, and I just sprayed a lot of it, basically, at that time, when I was wearing this, and I tried to make it so I could smell it, but. It's like, you really can't smell it. I guess somebody else can. I couldn't smell it, so I stopped wearing it. But anyway, once again, it's Shades of Blue for men. Uh, it's 8 bucks at Walmart. And uh, guys, if you like Dolce Cabana Light Blue, go for this. This is a, a really cheap alternative to it. Uh, it smells good. It's just a little bit on the light side, in my, in my opinion. I like my colognes to project a little bit in this. 
So uh, don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace out, YouTube. I don't know if you should get this or not. <laughs> but those of you who like it can get it, though. So, <laughs> All right, guys. Not that bad, though. Ain't the best, either.